Apparel, you Fashion Week fanatics. This is Fabiola Barracasa with New York Magazine at Pier 94 for the Rag and Bone Show. Very excited for it. Let's go check it out. I'm here because my boyfriend's walking in the show. Oh, really? Yeah. What's your boyfriend's name? Luke Worrell. Do you wear a lot of Rag and Bone? I do have a lot of Rag and Bone, and I was like, do I wear a Rag and Bone dress to a Rag and Bone show? I don't know, so I decided not to. Well, how do you feel about the name? Rag and Bone? Yeah. Well, I understand it because I'm English. And when I was a kid, the Rag and Bone Man was the man who came around collecting junk in a cart, horse-drawn cart, yelling Rag and Bone, Rag and Bone. You could bring out any trash because there was no trash collection you know, in England, in the 18th century when I was born. <laughs> what was the inspiration for this collection? Um, it started with a film about Joy Division called Control, but that led to like looking re research into like, English working class fashion, 60s, early 70s, and so just led back in time, skinheads and mods and rude boys. And in this incredible location, by the way, how did it come about? Uh, it's something really like raw and industrial and uh, you watch that film Control and you see sort of glimpses of Joy Division in the kind of concert venues and this sort of almost feels like a kind of warehouse sort of gig venue, you know. What's next for Rag and Bone? Stores. Uh, I was going to say a yeah. stiff drink. 